Ryan, when you're mapping the seabed and making charts, it's really important to know where you are, obviously. So um, how do we know where we are right now? What's the technology involved? Well, there's uh, thousands of satellites orbiting the Earth, and they're like little space stations up yep. in the sky. And a few of these are used as GPS positioning satellites. So it's sort of like a lighthouse sending a signal to your phone or to your computer. A GPS sends a signal at the speed of light, mm -hmm. and that allows you to see exactly where you are in the world. And having a clear view of the sky, you can get multiple satellites from anywhere in the world. And so you've, you've got something here that receives those signals. Yes, that's right. We've got two GPS antennas on the roof and they will receive signals from multiple satellites which can pinpoint your location. And you've got even more than just the GPS technology, haven't you? You've got something called motion sensor technology which corrects that data. Yes, that's right. So this vessel's got a built-in motion sensor on board and that takes uh, motion from the vessel and corrects the multi-beam data for that motion. So the surface of the sea is never flat. You're always affected on your vessel by wind and waves and swell. And so your vessel can roll, it can pitch, it can yaw, and it can move up and down, which is what we call heave. And the motion sensor will correct for all that and uh, apply that to your multi-beam data. Right, because if there's current, there's wind, there's swell, waves, you have data that's kind of up and down all over the place, that just smooths it all out. Yeah, makes it quite difficult to drive at some times as well. So yeah, having that motion sensor is uh, really handy.